It's starting. Okay, is it on? Yeah. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Welcome back for another night of our stories. We have Dragons Love Tacos 2, the sequel. I want to apologize. I don't have the original Dragons Love Tacos. We're just going to have to make do with the sequel tonight. So we'll give everybody a minute or so to get on here, and then we'll get started. And we had s'mores today. We did have s'mores today, didn't we? Yep, they were really good. Was that the first time you ever had s'mores? It's good s'mores weather, if anybody was wondering. It's a good time to have it, so. I hope you guys all had a good day today. I think one of the activities today was the egg and spoon race. I don't know if you guys got to do that. We didn't get to do that today. I think we'll do it tomorrow, but that sounds like fun. I can't wait to do it. So. The weather's been beautiful, so I hope you guys have been able to get outside and play and run around and get some of that energy out. So I hope you're being good for your moms and dads and grandmas and grandpas, whoever you're staying with right now. So let's go ahead and get started in on Dragon's Love Tacos 2, the sequel. Dun, dun, dun. This is by Adam Rubin and Daniel Samieri. This is at the book fair too, by the way, boys and girls, when we get back. Kid, why are all your dragon friends crying? They look so sad. Aww. Says no more tacos. World in shock. Emergency supplies depleted. I know I would be very sad if there were no more tacos my own self. Oh my, we've got to do something about this. Listen to me, dragons. Don't freak out. Because, you know, dragons love tacos, so. No wonder they're upset. Dragons love tacos. Remember that time we had an awesome taco party with dragons? There were so many tacos. Pant loads of tacos. Big tacos, little tacos, beef tacos, chicken tacos. And because of a totally honest mistake, I'm not blaming anyone here, there were also some spicy tacos. Unfortunately, spicy salsa gives dragons the tummy troubles. And when dragons get the tummy troubles, well, you know. But now, there are no more tacos. None, nada, nil. If only we could somehow go back in time to our delicious taco party, before the spicy salsa, of course. We could save a handful of tacos, plant them in the ground, and grow taco trees so we never run out of tacos again. I don't think that'll work. The dragons would be so happy. Well, I know we're not supposed to mess with it, but this does seem like the perfect opportunity to fire up that time machine in the garage. Do any of you have a time machine in the garage? A time machine lets you travel through time, back to the past when you were an itty bitty baby or forward to the future when you've grown to be an old man. Or, in our case, back to the taco party full of tacos. You know what? Let's strap into this gizmo and give it a whirl. Set the dial to taco party. Ready, set. Hey, that's you from before, weird. Well, there are plenty of tacos here. Let's just grab some and head back before the dragons eat any spicy, uh, oh, crunch, crunch, crunch. Hmm. Well, that says mild salsa, and that says mild salsa. Oh, no. I guess they ate the hot, spicy salsa. Yikes. I sure hope this time machine still works. Give the dial a little twist. We'll have to go a bit further back this time before the dragons eat any spicy salsa. Dragons eat spicy salsa. Back a little further there. Ready, set, Sam! Hmm, 
We may have gone a bit too far back. Crunch, crunch, crunch. I don't think these guys know what they're doing with this time machine. Oh boy, not again. I wonder if that's how the dinosaurs really became extinct. This time machine has seen better days. Try some machine oil. That might do the trick. Wait a second, that's not machine oil. This may complicate our journey through space time. It says machine oil brand salsa. Extra super duper spicy. Uh -oh. Dragons love diapers? That's not right. Let's try again. Yuck. Tacos love dragons? Weird, but closer. One more time. Sam. Dragons love tacos. That's it. Dragons, quick! Grab some tacos and let's get out of here before it's too late. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Sam. <sighs> we made it. Congratulations. Oh, come on. You saved one. Phew! We'll plant a tree and have tacos forever. The dragons will be so happy. After all, dragons love diapers. I, I mean, tacos. Dragons love tacos. Heck, everyone loves tacos. Oh, goodness. We have an astronaut. We have Abraham Lincoln. Let's see. We have fighters. Yeah. Frankenstein. What's that? Jimi Hendrix, maybe? Uh, Joan of Arc. Oh, that looks like Khaleesi. Who's Khaleesi? Cleopatra. A gymnast? Uh, yeah. That looks like Simone Biles over there. Hmm. This and might be John here. Wayne. Let's see here. Maybe Charles Lindbergh? Wow. Where's Everybody that? does love tacos. Wowzers. That's a bunch of The end. I hope you enjoyed our story tonight, and I hope you have a wonderful evening. We'll see you back tomorrow for our final story for a while because the next week we're on official spring break. So you don't have to do work next week. It's, it's all fun time. Have a great evening. Bye. Stay.